Hello everybody, c again with another Slice and Dice run and today I will be playing another challenge requested from Fatalista Gnostico and the challenge is named No Pain No Gain and uh, the idea here is going to be that I'm forced to pick up all the characters that have uh, pain on their sides if I find items that have pain I also have to pick those up too and uh, whenever I roll a pain side I'm forced to actually use it and lock it in so uh, the plan is to going to be to pick up the curator as he has a pain side, pick up the barbarian as he has the pain side, and pick up a dancer as she has the pain side. Although the rogues not don't really have that many pain sides, so I'm just gonna go with one rogue. And if the dancer happens, then I will pick her up. Otherwise, it is what it is. The main point here is being to pick up the curator and the barbarian. Uh, the truth, truth to be told, I could throw away these guys and uh, pick up some uh, defend keepers here to also have, um, you know, undying. I think that would be smarter than using those and I was also thinking about picking a healer to you know heal up the pain as I'm gonna be forced to use them and also at the tier 2 I will be be forced to use a berserker at least. So uh, that means the team is this one. So I have a rogue at the top just to dodge you know the insta kill mechanics that are in the game maybe if I get a dodge roll and also some damage because the, the top and the bottom position are pretty much damage heavy and then the, the, the second most damage heavy position is the middle one as every single cleave attack of the enemies no matter where it's gonna be placed here here or here it's still gonna hit the middle one and then the, the healer is at the bottom to heal out i think that's going to be the team i'm going to do it on easy mode just to have more life and me having more life and not the enemies having less because I'm most of the time doing these with the enemies having less. Let's go with me having more for once, you know, just to be within the parameters that uh, actually matter. Uh, let's start. Ah, parameters. What am I even talking about? Sometimes I'm, I'm I'm just blabbering random stuff, but what I'm trying to say is uh, this is more important than me to me than uh, anything else. Ah, that's a kill. Let's try to play this also as fast as possible. I mean, the plan is pretty much laid out. Uh, let's go with the soldier. I mean, overall DPS upgrade is pretty decent. Uh, no items. Oh, boohoo. <laughs> let's continue. But the warrior here is almost dying instantly. 3, 2, 1. Let's reroll. Maybe some damage here. 2 and... Well, so we go... Um, and 1 and a 2 and a 3 and a kill. And uh, that would be it. Next turn, I will definitely get a mana on the Acolyte, being able to help us out with the damage too. Maybe the Acolyte was not that much of a smart idea, now that I'm thinking back into it. Maybe I should have gone for, I guess, uh, a defender, but uh, it's not like it's that important, I think. It's it's pretty much tomato, potato, whatever. Uh, there is no... Let's go with max HP. I saw nothing that was even hinting at... Pain, so I was avoiding it. I, I don't think there was any pain item in the early game either way, so let's roll here some stats. Yeah, let's do this and let's roll one more. Maybe nah, shield. I should have gone with the one damage. Man, I should have gone with one damage. Uh, let's shield the soldier and let's go. As you see, sideways attacks actually do happen a lot in this game, so outside heroes are always in the risk of getting hit. To damage, you can roll more obviously here. Two damage is decent, one and a two and a three. And uh, four, I guess a burst over there. You know what? Let's actually not kill that guy. Uh, let's just make sure I'm gonna get everything first, damage-wise, and then I can kill them. Because you never know, man. This is a dice game. You never know what's gonna happen. Okay, at this point, I know what's gonna happen. <laughs> let's go with... Oh, our baby Zirker has arrived, so that's an insta-pick, no questions asked. And now we start the challenge. This is locked instantly. No choices in the matter. Let's go with healing on you. So let's go one and a two and a three and a four and heal and let's go. Pretty decent, pretty decent. Let's go. I think we're instantly winning here. One and two. Let's reroll. Uh, I'm 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 gonna add another thing to the challenge and I'm gonna say that uh, if I don't roll pain sides, I should actually reroll. Is that a good idea to add to the challenge? Let's go with the shuriken. As a twin dagger, so I'm not even sure if it's, they're going to be useful. Overall, they're useful, but I don't know if they're going to be useful in the long run. While the shurikens will stay useful forever. Should I add more difficulty to the challenge? We will see. I I'm thinking about yes. I'm thinking about um, forcing myself to reroll until I get a... Forcing myself to reroll ent until I get a pain side. Uh, might not really be fun, but uh, I mean, a challenge is a challenge. And uh, fun is not really part of the equation here. <laughs> it's just... Uh, 
What's it called? It's uh, increasing the difficulty, you know. Okay, he can roll better for sure. Man is decent here. He is forced to re-roll. At least in my book. From here on out, yeah, I will do that. I will I will re-roll every single side that's not a pain side. That might make it so that we lose, though. Yeah, I'm sure it might make us lose. You know what? I'm gonna... Hmm. Should I should I say from now that I will break the, the rule if, if I need to? Get the hero to 6. I mean, region and 2 mana is decent. AoE healing. Yeah, let's go with this. Especially with the AoE healing part. Let's give the max HP to the Trapper now that he has the last one. I don't know. Is it a good idea? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. The, the challenge didn't specify. The challenge only said that, uh, you know, lock... Lock the lock the die if it is a uh, pain side die. That's the only thing I know. You know, I'm, I'm gonna play it as it's written. So for for now, we will see. Okay, I will I will not lock myself into either pain or nothing. But right now, I can still re-roll here. I mean, there's no reason to not try to roll the pain side right now. So here you go. Was that an overkill? Uh, no, it was exactly. It was exact lethal. Let the enemy attack us. Berserker almost dying. Ports. Okay, and uh, that should be a kill actually. Let's see what we get. <laughs> Gambler says trash. The most trash item I have seen. Uh, one man on the first turn. Let's go with random item. Ah, oh, that's also trash. Uh, it might be useful in somebody that has trash in the middle. So for now, let's keep it. Not trash, at least something that uh, doesn't care about uh, the middle roll. I will reroll. This. Should I reroll this though? I guess it's called no pain no gain, so um, I don't have a defender. Two shielding is gonna save the medic. Let's reroll the rest. Here you go. Let's reroll the rest. Didn't roll a single damage, almost. Almost didn't roll a single damage. Almost. Off you go. Off you go. Heal this team and shield, uh, I guess, him for safety reasons. Although now that I think about it, these archers, if they roll the target... Oh, they don't have the target thing. Okay, medic's dying, as always. Whoops. That's what happens. Let's go for the AoE healing. And uh, let's go for some assassination attempt here. Soldier, my dude. Okay, that's decent-ish. Here you go. Uh, kaboom. And you're dead, and you're dead. And uh, shield the berserker. In case he rolls another pain die. I mean, should I play it on ultra difficulty and say that if he rolls a pain die in the end, I should still have to roll it? I mean, might as well go bring the difficulty up. I am going to use those, though. I, I am going to use those when when I roll them. Uh, I would say yes to the Trapper, to be honest. Brute is also decent, but the Trapper is always a good choice. Having the insta-kill and the range damage being nice. Yeah, the Trapper is always a good choice. I mean, Brute, Brute is decent, too, obviously. But there are also other Warriors that are decent. Uh, let's give this to the Warrior, I guess. And, uh, yeah, here, for example, I could do this and kill some one-shot enemies. And uh, even if I roll the X side, I still would get something undying for the first two turns. For three skeletons. For three skeletons. Um, I don't know. I could. No, I have never accepted the challenge in these. Let's accept the challenge once. Now, uh, I instantly get the item, by the way, so let's give that here, and uh, I will not go for the insta-kill, as nothing has more than 4 health, so I might as well get the insta-kill on the 4th health. And the reinforcement's coming in, too. Okay, so, keep, keep, let's try to get the one-shot on this guy, or at least the dodge, so any of those two are gonna save us. Other one shot, neither the, neither the dodge, none of those. So, who's killing you, man? Bones, this this guy, this dude, is that your problem? Here you go. Let's kill this guy too. Whoop. Let's uh, start attacking him, and uh, I guess uh, that would be it. She, the medic, rolled trash. Whoop. Whoop. By the way, all the limits, every single limit got an attack roll in. I really like the sound effects in this game. Uh, let's go for an insta kill here. Let's get the three damage kill. I mean, we can get rid of things. Who are you killing? Are you? Okay, if I kill the Slimlet, he's going to survive. So I just need to kill a bunch of units, that's what I get. Uh, you should roll mana to help out with the killing a bunch of units part. Wait, is that true? Yeah, I mean it is, at least in my book. Uh, let's go with... Uh, Reroll? Am I still forcing myself into this uh, stupid idea? I guess... Uh, yeah, let's reroll. 
Okay, it happened though. I was lucky. Let's remove this guy. So I removed two with one hit. You're toast. You're toast. Nobody's dying. Boop. Easy peasy. Lemon. Squeezy. Is that though a bit cringy to say that thing? Maybe a bit. Let's go for the AoE healing. Uh, let's reroll here. I mean, the Berserker's gonna die if he rolls the the pain side. Well, he did. Uh, I guess AoE healing and yeah, Berserker's dead. Here you go. Uh, let's do this and maybe this. Huh. Yeah, I guess the Berserker can kill her. Okay, everybody's dying. Yeah, let's keep this. Yeah, okay, I, you know what? At this point, I have decided to not force myself to reroll pain sides, okay? I'm, I'm gonna lock it in as the challenge requested, but there's no reason to make this challenge extremely more difficult and then even losing, so... Let's try to at least, you know, win. Can you get a Wii, please? Okay, that's decent too. So, uh, let's get rid of the boss. That would be 3 plus 2, equal 5. It's toast. But he's still dying. Okay... I can actually not kill him. I have to save one of those two, which I actually can't even do. Okay, maybe the boss wasn't killing enough people? Okay... I mean, I can kill this guy. With the boss reviving. I will lose the soldier, though. Okay, better to lose the soldier than lose two units. Because I could not save any of those two. And uh, I would say, let's go here and here. The next turn I can kill these two and maybe the Slime Queen at the same moment. And uh, let's start healing the Berserker. This is gonna go swimmingly, man. This is like the worst fight I ever had. Uh, I'm forced. Let's go with... Man, actually healing, I would say. So at least he survives. Man, I could get a kill though. Wait, who's dying? He's dying from the Slimlets. Yeah, if she rolls a heal, then we can kill the Slimlets and we will be good to go. This is a kill on the Slimlet, so that's nice. Medic's pretty much dying, so we can forget the Medic existing. Is that true? That seems stupid as an idea. No, I just need to roll a mana. She, he can kill the... the yeah, yeah, I can, I can definitely do something with this. Uh, heal the Berserker. Uh, this guy is gonna kill the Slimlet that's killing the Berserker, so she can heal the Berserker, so the Berserker can kill this. I need to roll him at least one damage. If he doesn't roll damage, we're done. That was lucky. So we go here, we go here, and then we go here, and here. Perfect. Didn't lose anybody. Didn't lose anybody. Okay, the decision has been made. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm allowed to reroll whenever I want, but the pain sides are gonna lock me in. I mean, there was no... <laughs> Okay, it's, it's, it feels like I'm changing the rules on the fly, but uh, if I don't change the rules right now, I'm gonna instantly lose. So uh, I don't find any reason to just lose, you know, because of uh, schematics. Keep this. Can you roll like something other than nothing? Okay, that's that's decent, you know, that's decent. Uh, let's go for a maybe kill here. And now let's go for the actual kill there. Okay, and uh, now I can like burst this guy down. I could renew my own allies, but I'm gonna burst these tanks down. Okay, I I'm forced. Let's go. Here, I'm even gonna use it. Here, here, here. I'm even gonna use it. I don't know why I... Yeah, I don't know why I was like, let's go and the while the warrior rolled the shield. But I mean, it was a definite win. Let's go. Uh, upon death for mana, growth size increased by an additional one when used. Uh, I mean, let's go for this. You never know. There are so many healers that have growth sides. And I'm still not gonna use that for now. Let's continue. We roll. Here you go for the insta kill plus this. This is an insta kill on something, I guess. Let's reroll here. The warrior is supposed to be dying. I don't see him dying today. Come on, Berserker. No, man. No, man. I trusted you, man. Let's go. Uh, okay. All these ghosts. I, it wouldn't be an insta kill, by the way, if we kill this guy. Perfect. Uh, yeah, that's it, actually. Let's not uh, dwindle. Uh, I don't have that much shielding, so this is really bad. Uh, this is useless and these are meh. So let's go for a bunch of choices, I guess. Max health. Uh, give it over here. Wait a minute. 
Mm, do the enemies have five life? Only the quartz is five life. Who cares? I'm gonna kill the snipers either way. Oh, let's go. I mean with a trapper, by the way. Uh, here is a kill on the snipers, as I said. This is two damage, so might as well keep it. I know there's a three damage choice, but this is two damage. Actually, he has so many two damage choices. Two damage, two damage, two damage, two damage, and this is gonna help out. Um, you can roll a three attack, and if you're gonna roll a two attack again, I'm gonna keep it. Obviously forced. Let's go here for the spread attack. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, we go one and two. And uh, now we go like, who's doing the most damage? And shielding. If this guy rolled two damage, this was a kill too. And if the medic rolled mana, I don't know. It's not like a whoops, locked in. Doot, 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 and the snipers are dead. Let's go here. Let's obviously use it too, just to, you know, keep the spirit alive. And uh, engage the middle side or single use to all growth sides and plus two to growth sides. No, I really don't like this, by the way. I don't know. This item, I don't know why it's level 5. I really, really don't like this. I mean, maybe there has been balance. Engage to the middle side. Does anybody have, like, something good in the middle? I guess he. He could do, like, 3 damage instantly. A bunch of people. Oh, engage. Ooh, I could use it on her. That would mean that it's gonna heal too. Let's pick this. There are so many good items to use for this. Let's, let's for now do it on this one. So that I can start... No, 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 let's go for the AoE. Let's go for the big AoE hits. <laughs> Whoops. Let's roll it, maybe. Mm, no. We keep those. Uh, I can reroll this. I can try my luck. Yeah, I can keep this. And luck has been not rolled, so we keep those. Uh, he or Whatever he rolls, it's going to be damage. So might as well reroll here. Okay, let's start getting rid of some bones. Um, I guess now shots are better. Oh, no, no, I can do like this, this, this. Very nice. Now I can kill this bones too. See? And now I can set up the kill on this plus this, which is gonna chain into the bottom one. Oh, I, I could have killed the top bones. Well, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. The enemies aren't even attacking the medic. Yep, insta kill, insta kill. We won. Here you go. Boop, boop, boop. And snipe. Poison. And, uh,. I guess I'm forced to pick here. Uh, we will go with the veteran. Just uh, keeping up with uh, straight up good items. Here you can have the shuriken. And uh, let's continue. Zombie here. Yep, zombie's dead. Uh, that's useless. This is also mediocre. Yeah, not really anything good to see here. I mean, this could kill a skeleton right away, so uh, he's gonna instantly kill the zombie, and then if we do four, five damage, can we do five damage? Yeah, we definitely can do five damage. And then this guy can instantly kill a skeleton, so not gonna be complete trash. Yeah, that's like, f yep, we just rolled five damage. You know what? No. You know what? No. <laughs> Region or man is better. Okay, so we will go with insta-kill here. Attack the big life guy. Pretty much insta-kill. Insta-kill. He'll uh, heal him. A bunch of bones. I'm definitely gonna be able to defeat the bones as long as this guy is not doing anything. I'm doing so much damage so quickly that uh, I'm I'm not afraid about some bones. Here you go, one bone down. Yeah, that's maybe mediocre, but it is what it is. It's like here, help out on this side, and then this guy can like destroy them. I got even more bones coming in. You know, if I'm gonna do that, then uh, might as well go for this. And definitely not hit this bone so that it doesn't spawn more right now. Uh, go for a shield here. Mm, is that a good idea? Not killing those bones. I don't think it's a good idea. Yeah, let's keep the man up. I don't think it's a good idea because uh, I can chain bones killing each other. And I, I'm even, I, right now I'm not even losing here an insta-kill on a bone. Uh, this is going to be an insta-kill later. This is also an insta-kill pretty much. All of those things are gonna chain into each other. Here, AoE is also very nice. So we go with the AoE engage on uh, this side. So they lost two each. Now, I can do like this. I can do this. I can do this. And I can also burst. Is that even smart which I did, what I did? Hmm. I'm thinking about popping him so more bones arrive, but uh, I'm not sure that's a good idea right now because if more bones arrive right now, the next turn, yeah, let's let's make the bones arrive at the next turn, so that uh, come on, roll no. So now if I summon bones, I can still chain kill them. So this is forced. 
this is okay, I guess. Actually, no. Let's let's try to roll the three damage side. Three damage, one. Mm, ah, man, one man, I guess. Ah, shield. Wow, I obviously squandered my chances here. Bones into bones. Let's do this, to be honest, so that this summons more bones, and now I can kill this bones to to damage the other one. I'm obviously gonna kill it. There's like literally no reason to get hit, and uh, yeah, I mean next turn we should be winning. So I have burst to kill the lich and the bones and anything in between. So I just need to roll. Uh, that's enough. Actually, let's let's make sure we win. You know, let's make a hundred percent sure we win right now. Okay, at this point I'm hundred percent sure I'm winning. So uh, we go with the one shot on the lich, and we go with the pain as it's forced, quote unquote. Uh, replace all shield sides with range damage sides. Hmm, I don't know what could I pay. Uh, oh, what? Imagine that. <laughs> I'm kidding, obviously. Uh, let's continue. Pain forced. Yes. Uh, I mean, it's decent. It's gonna really quickly go up. Uh, he can roll better. Both of them can be roll better. Yes, that's really, really, really good. Maybe his best side. Look at this. 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Man, that's huge. Uh, let's go for a kill on the ghost. Let's go for a kill on the... Oh, I want to kill this wisp. It's going to spawn skeletons. Uh, let's go for a kill on the ghost. And let's start damaging this wisp. I don't care that's going to spawn a skeleton. Now that it has one life, man, it's going to die. <laughs> skeletons? Yeah, someone skeletons. <laughs> your, 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 uh, your funeral. Here, two damage is enough. Yep, yep. And when I say yep, I mean forced. And yep, so boop, and boop, done. And uh, whoa, we found an answer, perfect. Perfect, perfecto. Now this is useless, obviously, but uh, I mean, the dancer is exactly what I wanted. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Give this to the dancer, try to roll, no, give this to the dancer. Uh, I trash completely one side, but uh, it's not plus one, minus two, it's plus one, minus one. So I'm trading one cantrip damage to a two damage. Uh, you lose two life, but the, the enemies all lose two life. And uh, if that hill kills the snake, then everybody's dead. Rolled it. Perfect, 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 perfect. Perfect. I think we won. We do this, we do this, we do this, we do this, it doesn't matter. Uh, we, look at this. Look at this now. This is gonna be huge. Are you ready? Are you ready? Boom. Got a kill. Boom. Got a kill. Boom. Easiest fight of my life. After a spell's cast, self shield 2. Add plus 1 and heavy to all damage sides. I mean, yes. Damage means bows too, right? Uh, does that count for her too? Oh, what? It counts for her too? For the cantrips? She has a 5 damage side, by the way. Yeah, we go for the 3 damage instead of kill destruction of everything. She's gonna lose 3 life per pop, but uh, I think the damage difference is gonna be huge. Uh, yes, uh, let's reroll this for the so that we actually do roll the pain side this time. Imagine that. Our shot. Again, let's go for the pain sides. Perfect, perfect. Look at this, we go 1 and a 2 and a 3 and a 4. Easy peasy. Man, this is huge. Uh, I still haven't found the... Yeah, I'm not gonna pick up the Brawler. I'm obviously gonna pick up the Mender, especially with uh, Regen 1 to everybody, and Max Life, and save, rescue. Yeah, let's go with the Mender. Uh, inventory, here you go. I mean, I, I'm not gonna gain enough mana to ever press the Smooth button, but the Sooth button. Uh, 3 damage could kill the top spider. I'm not gonna kill Tarantus this time. No, he can roll better. I mean, he has 4, 4, 4, and 3. Why would I keep the least amount damage of damage he can do? Yeah, let's let's go for more damage here, please. Mm, no, no. Yes, that's enough. Yep, that's healing. Okay, so he rolled the 3 damage side 3 times. What a crazy dude. Yeah, let's get rid of it. Oh, it's heavy. Cancel. Cancel. Uh, the non... Oh, I have 2 heavy things? Okay. I cannot kill all the spiders. Well, we let the spider that does damage survive, I guess. And we go for the smooth, obviously. Sooth, smooth, I don't know. I guess it's sooth. I don't know why I would say I don't know. Uh, yeah, let's go for sooth. Let's reroll, obviously. Let's go for some damages. Uh, yep, that's forced. 
Uh, I mean, two damage is good. But he could roll better. He's not even getting damaged. Okay, I mean, he rolled the same thing. Because he's not getting damaged, let's remove poison. First and foremost, and another poison. And uh, this is forced. And uh, I guess heal him. Is he doing four damage and poison? This guy's crazy, man. And uh, let's kill this one too. And I guess let's go for Sooth to start healing a bit. That's that's, uh, that's actually really crazy, by the way. I need the Dancer to roll five damage. I guess you can die in peace. Um, how is he dying? Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess that's the best she can actually roll. Come on, roll better, boys. Yes. Um, I guess yes. I think I tried to kill the Tyrannus right now. Can I save him? No. If I kill the Tyrannus, though... Nope. Oh, no. Actually, that is what I had to do. But why is this guy all X's? Poison? What? This thing? This thing is poison and... Whoa, it's poison and weaken. Wow. Okay. Okay, at this point, I have one, obviously. So, uh, yeah, let's... Let's just win. I mean, I say obviously because I have two damage dealers. Here you go. This is a kill. And this is another kill. And with the mana, we won. You see, we do one. We do one. Two. One. Three. Done. Even if they have less life, it's okay. Bloodlust. And minus one to top and bottom. This is going to be heavy, so it's always going to attack. No, but I cannot use this then. Okay. She's going to instantly kill everybody. Uh, minus one about bloodlust. Add steel to the middle side. I'm not really shielding, per se. Let's go with random item. Plus one still with two pips originally. Okay, that would be only this guy. Oh, or one more mana. Mm, I think this guy is the better one. Because uh, this one more mana means that if I... Uh, the first cast is going to be nothing. The second cast is going to be one Sooth. And the third cast is going to be another Sooth. If I play this here... Yeah, then that's what's going to happen. If I don't play place this here, then the fourth cast is going to be a Sooth. Uh, I think more Sooths are actually more important. I have so much damage. I just need survivability and healing. Oh, the plans change. I will keep re-rolling this. This is three damage. This is going to be a kill. This is forced. This is a very good side to roll. Okay. This is very good. Come on. Let's... No. Uh, kill here. Forced. Uh, I guess kill here. I guess kill here. I guess kill here. And everybody's alive. So let's start healing the dancer. As uh, she might actually die within her own round. Oh, no, it was because the enemies have uh, thorns or something. Yeah, no, no, that's cancel that. Uh, yeah, we, we won. Look at this. Boom. Dancer. I love the dancer. Whoop, we found the barbarian. Let's make him death immune in the first round. Wait a minute. Can I not make the dancer? You know what? I'm going to make the dancer death immune in the first round. He might die otherwise. Look at what's here. One, two, three, four imps. She's instantly going to die. Is she, though? I'm starting to think she's not instantly going to die. By the way, this goes here. Um, I mean, this guy is not gonna die in the first two turns, but the heavy and the mine. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm keeping everything as this. I know there's it's four imps, but if she rolls the damage, we instantly win. Uh, I need you to roll four damage. You roll two. You can roll better. Yeah, everybody can roll something better. Okay, that's four damage. That's a kill. That's three damage, that's a kill on something. That's three damage, that's also a kill on something. Ah. I guess five damage. So, get rid of the imp. Uh, start damaging this imp. Get rid of the... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Why did I get rid of the imp? Who cares about skeletons, man? Let, let him summon them. I just want to not get poisoned. Here, oh. As long as I'm not getting poisoned, I'm a happy camper. Okay, I obviously will remove one skeleton if I have the chance to do that. Let's uh, heal this guy and let's go. I just need to roll the dancer attack and we win instantly. It's one roll, instant win. It's like you roll a six, you win. This is a kill on something. This is a kill on something. Gonna help. Uh, yeah. Let's re-roll. Let's re-roll. Okay. I guess this is a forced attack. Let's go for the imp. Uh, let's 
two of the bones. Let's, uh, let's, I guess, kill the bones to kill some things around. Boop. And uh, now I can, like, also kill this imp for no poison. I mean, the, the dancer's gonna get poisoned, but uh, we're not gonna allow that to happen, I said. And we won another easy fight. Yeah, I mean, keep. Here you go. Let's go. Uh, add growth and plus one to the right side. Add cleave and pain to the middle side. I'm gonna go with add cleave and pain. As um, I think it's... Uh, I'm forced to do that. So, uh, yeah, let's go with cleave and pain. And uh, you know where, what I'm gonna, who I'm gonna give this to? This this person. Because this thing now is gonna give ev four, three people of my team for life. And if I give herself the buff too, she will uh, not even lose life. So that's huge. Let's continue. I think, yeah, I think we're good to go. Uh, let's see. This is four damage to everybody in Cleave. Four damage to three people. Should I go for four damage to three people? That's a really good AoE. Yeah, let's go for that. Cancel. Cancel. No. Nope. This one. Yeah, it's four damage, but uh, yeah, I can now... Four damage, but I take four, but I do like 12 or something. Decent. Oh, 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 really good. I thought so, actually, when I saw it. Yes. Uh, He can definitely roll better. Actually, I don't need to keep this. This is good. Let's go. Okay. So we go with this. Now this does five. Uh, let's try to get rid of the poisoner. Okay, let's begin normal. So you do two to everybody. You do three. You do five. You do this. And we got rid of the poisoner, boys. Poisoner is down. Poisoner is down. I mean, the poison was temporary, obviously. It's not like he was the poison. <laughs> who, who, who... Did not know that it was gonna happen. I was like, sure. I was like, 100% sure. Didn't say it, but... The moment I started talking about the poison, I was sure, so sure, man. I was like, definitely gonna get poisoned. Let's go here, let's go here, let's go here, and let's go... You know, this, uh, this three damage was not needed. That's min-max, boys. Always min-max when you have the chance to... Or the chance, the choice, whatever. Especially if it's easy, man. If it's an easy choice to just see, uh, to just decide if you want to min max or not, just just min max. Um, let's go with leader. We arrived at the end, by the way. I could go leader into into the Mender's Pain side. By the way, Brawler's like useless. I mean. He can stun the, the, the Hexia forever after she goes down to 14 life. If I roll it. While this guy can definitely help us early game and keep us alive. Especially, man. Yeah, we go for this. <laughs> uh, we go with Engage, etc, etc on him so that he can... Wait a minute. By the way, this is a joke, but wouldn't this be awesome? Look at this. Copy to everybody, 3 damage, Engage, Pain, and then boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 and I'm dead. I, I'm not gonna yolo it that hard. I'm obviously gonna use this. Uh, give this to him. Yeah, a lot better on him. And uh, I think it's... Yeah, I mean, this is like target ally against 3 to all damage and shield sides this turn. And then I could give it to the answer and... I guess. I mean, with her, I would like really to roll this from here or not. Or just give him the shuriken, man. What am I talking about? Here you go. Uh, does anybody have anything that's... No. Okay, let's go. Okay, Mandra's dying right away. That's... Uh, is that the pain side? No. So, sh so, so she can save herself. <laughs> uh, you can roll the Ultra Mega side, please. No. Yes. Ultra Mega side, please. No. Okay, free damage here. Uh, let's go for the kill. Wait a minute. Fuck! Ooh. No, 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 I want to do this. Ah, cool. Yeah, done. We didn't even get poisoned. That's how we roll. That's how we roll. Mender dying. Mender can't even cast. She has pain on everything. Uh, yeah, I mean, she has pain on everything, so... And she also rolled the pain side. I was gonna lock it in either way for the jokes and the memes, but... <laughs> um, you know what? I could keep this. If I keep this... I mean, I have units to do damage. If I keep this, 
uh, yeah, I will keep this. There, there are a lot of reasons. Because uh, Hexia, by the way, has a passive that says I take as much damage I do. And uh, if some of my units are going to do a lot of damage, I'm most likely going to lose some. So, let's kill this guy. Let's do this one. Let's do this and this. You see, that's how she would die. So now she won't. I can do this. By the way, I could also do this. Obviously, she would die. Wait a minute. If she doesn't attack... Yeah, she will die for sure. Let's do this. What? This has pain and cleave. It has pain and engage. I thought it was pain and cleave. What? Let me read the item again. Engage. I gave her the wrong uh, item. I gave it to him. Cleaving pain. Oh no. Oh no. No way, man. I gave her the wrong item. Why would I give him this thing? He doesn't need the cleave in this fight. Oh man. We are super dead. You can roll better. Uh, What are you doing? She's summoning. Who cares? Let's go damage on. Here for damage. Uh... Oh, he got petrified. Yeah, man, I cannot remove it. Just so you know. Uh, here. You're useless. I mean, she did. <laughs> Two damage. Is this only ranged? Attack rolls also takes... Oh, man. Go with the... Re go, roll something better, man. Roll the two damage. Okay, three damage. Better than two damage. Here you go. Here you go. Uh, here you go. And uh, let's heal the mender so she doesn't die. I need the leader to roll this thing, the two damage duplicate. Ah, maybe the veteran's gonna save the day. Whoops, that's forced. Come on, veteran. You got the side we wanted you to not have. <laughs> let's reroll. Okay, let's reroll for damage at least. Yes. When she and the, and the leader also help out. So let's first begin with suiciding the barbarian. <laughs> let's go with this is first, no matter what happens. Because it's free. So can we actually beat Hexia right now? Guys, we're doing it. yolo <laughs> Uh, Yeah, no YOLO, I don't care. We did it. We won. Wow, that was so weird. This is my... Wow, that was that was like an extremely weird turn of events and how we won. Here, let's go with Burst. The Bender got the win. I don't care. Man, the leader gave us that win. The leader gave us that win. Without the leader, this chain of events would not happen this way. I mean, I think we would still win, but uh, man, this uh, this end, the ending was awesome. I don't know. I really like the ending. It was like a, like, like everything fell together. So the, the I don't know. I, I really like the ending, especially the part where I used the heal to save my ally, which in the end wasn't actually useful. But because I had the what's it called? Because I had the leader, I could have I I got the swords and then I chained everything into each other. I, I really like this. Uh, yeah, I mean, that was the challenge. Once again, I went into easy mode because I thought it was going to be extremely hard. Uh, we were a bit lucky. We didn't roll pains when we needed to. I I, I interrupted the... What's it called? I, I stopped the challenge that I said I would do. That I would re-roll the normal sides for pain sides. But that was not the requested challenge. So I guess uh, it passes. I don't know. If it doesn't pass, then I guess comment down below and tell me. No, Sif doesn't count. I don't know. Yeah, I would like to hear your opinions on the matter, but uh, I like the challenge. I like challenges, by the way. So if somebody wants to suggest a challenge to me, just uh, tell me to do it. Um, I will prefer to do the challenge in easy. I mean, if I'm going to do if I'm gonna do the challenge on easy, that means that you can give me like an extremely difficult challenge if you have like some kind of idea. Um, otherwise, you could like give me a lighter challenge so that I could do it on normal or hard if you want to incorporate the curses. Because if you think about it, the challenge is pretty much a curse that you self-inflict on yourself. So instead of going and playing with the hard curses, which are pretty much, you know, you have less life, enemies have more life. We're playing with something that's a bit more fun. At least that's the idea in my mind. So also, if you would like me to test some kind of custom layout, you know, some, some particular teams then I would really be happy to oblige, I guess. Uh, especially when you, if you have some ideas about classes, etc., I could also do that. Uh, just uh, I want to just to point out that, as you saw, you don't always get all your classes. I said I was going to go with the uh, dancer here for the pain and uh, the other guys with the pain, and it happened that they rolled along. One other time, I wanted to go for cantrips, and uh, it was pretty much almost the same. Yeah, I wanted, like, the dancer, and then I wanted two mages in particular. I wanted the sorcerer and the chronos, 
for the rerolls and it didn't happen so um, today i was lucky that i got the three characters i wanted even though custom seems to give them easier it's not always true if you go back and look at the footage i think i never had access to venom i never had access to sharpshooter so maybe in the fighter section I, I don't remember did i have access to all of these guys all that happened this happened this happened curator didn't happen oh no yeah uh, i didn't do the curator wait how did that happen yeah, because, yeah, I didn't... <laughs> you see, that's what I was talking about. I wanted, obviously, to pick up the curator, but... It's... it's. If you remember, the leader was, like, the last character I picked up, so... It's not like I skipped the curator. If I skipped the curator, I hope it was for the dancer, and I hope I didn't get forgetful. But, uh... No, my team was the veteran, was it? Wait, it was either veteran or... I think it was either veteran or something for the healer, I think. I, I don't remember exactly. Maybe I, maybe, maybe I skipped the curator. Guys, I hope I didn't scope the curator. I don't know. I mean, I'm going to read it in the comments below. And there's no reason to think about it right now. I can go back in the footage and look at it at my, <laughs> at my own free time, I guess. Either way, uh, that's going to be it. So if you guys liked the video, drop a like, helping out my channel. And if you would like to tell me anything, as for example, if I skipped the curator or not, you can just comment down below. I'm going to read it. Timestamps are always welcome so that I can go into the footage and uh, understand what you're telling me. But uh, if it's something random, I, it doesn't matter. And once again, if you would uh, like to submit a challenge or something, I could also do that. If you would like to try a team that I would, you would like me to try a team i would do that too maybe an item build i mean the thing is with the items they are completely random so i mean if you suggest something to me it might not happen so um yeah i think that's going to be it if you like to support the channel by the way you could help me over at patreon uh, I mean, the words aren't really that great, but uh, you will have at least your name on the screen and not only for 10 or 20 seconds like the rest of the YouTubers do. I'm having them here for two minutes while I'm analyzing or thinking about stuff. So I guess if you would like to have that happen to you, help me there. Otherwise, that's going to be it. Thanks for watching and see you guys around.